Welcome back to another episode of the F-Zero GX series. I am Alderson, and today we will be taking on the Sapphire Cup with the Deep Claw. Make sure you leave a like on this video, and please subscribe if you are interested in the series and any other videos I have on my channel. And if you do subscribe, click the bell. With that said, let's be off. Big Blue Drift Highway. Now this track, the computers, especially on the higher difficulties, they do very well. So we need to focus, get a good spot, and just have fun. That's the whole point of these racing games is have fun. But if you're like me, you want some competition, and that's why we do Master Difficulty. Uh, watch out for the cars. The trick to, to beating this track is not bumping into the, the walls or the cars. Oh, we kind of messed up there, but that's okay. That's okay. We're 14th spot, 13th spot. Not doing terribly. Heck, we could be doing worse. We could be doing worse. This is one of those tracks where I could get dead last. It is seriously not an easy track to, to get a good spot on. With that said, let's let's focus on getting a good spot. Just gotta watch out for these cars. Get the dash plates. And oh uh oh, I'm using way too much of my boost. I should have more boost. This is not good. This is not good. I need to be careful. I need to be careful. All right, gotta get through. Gotta get through. Gotta get through. There we go. Boost like a madman. Oh, oh man. Did we get seventh? Yes. All right. That's a decent spot for this track, but usually I get like mid-table, sometimes in the 20th. So we got 7th place. Not bad, not bad. Port Town, Aerodive. This track, it's a lot longer. It's a lot longer than the big blue track. So, managing your boost is critical. Also, those rifle cars, the, that right now is first place. If we can just scoot along and kill him, there we go. I think we got him. And, uh, oh my gosh, these, these cars are being really aggressive. I just wanna, you know, get the dash plates, play nice, play nice, so, or not, you know. I killed someone, so who am I to say? Who am I to talk? Uh, oh, we missed the dash plate, no. It's not the end of the world, though. So, we'll take a, a right. Dash plate. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure if the person we killed is the rival. But I hope it is, because that would really help us in the long run. Because that would mean that they would be unable to get points this race. And any points we get would be gained. It would be a win for us, pretty much. But, you know, us being um, Grand Prix challengers, we want to be able to win as many tracks as possible. And this is definitely one of the tracks I can win, definitely. But the next track, Moby Spring, I don't know about that one. That one's a little bit harder. Come on, let's get let's pull ahead. There we go. Alright, this is where I use up most of my boost, if not all of it. The final section of the track, and then we just heal up. And we can let him go get first because it's only the. Now it's the final lap, but we've got a whole nother lap to go. And we're sitting comfortably in third, now second place. So, just, just keep going ahead. Gotta be careful on this track though. Anything could happen and that would ruin your record. It would ruin your first place hopes. But, as you can see, the guys ahead of us, they're beeping. They're flashing. And that's good for us because that means they don't have boost power. But we do because we manage our boost. So, 
but he used it up. And now, oh gosh, I just did a really bad mistake. But it's okay, because I managed my boost like a good boy, and we got first place. Alright. That's what I said. Alright, first place. Alright. Where do we sit now? Third place? We are just a couple points off of first. So, we're sitting nice and tight in third place. Green plant, the Mobius frame. I love the music in this place. I love it. I don't know if I can learn this on piano though. It's way too techno. It's just... I don't think there are any piano tutorials, but... That put aside, we need to focus on getting a good spot on this track. Because I don't know if I can win it. I can win it, I am capable, but sometimes things go wrong and I get like... Third, fifth, whatever. But any top five spot is... Definitely more than welcome. Definitely. Yeah, we just just killed someone for fun. And killing people's fun. In fact, in the old old F Zero X game, the one for the Nintendo 64, which I might be doing a uh, uh, a you know a series on eventually, they have this game mode called Death Race, and that's basically where you kill the computer for fun. Whoa, 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 uh, but see, that's what happens when I talk when I play. I lose track. Almost lost. I almost went off the track, actually, so. Yeah. Things ain't looking too good for us, but, it, you know. The next track, I can win. The next track, I can win rather easily. But then the win after that is a very, very difficult challenge. But if we can finish ahead of our rival, then that would be splendid. Very splendid. I, I suppose you could say Octoman is a, a splendid red engine. Like from Tom's the Tank Engine. I mean, he's red. He's an engine. He's a splendid red engine. And uh, he would be a, a destroyed red engine if we're not careful. And we, well, die. I always die in these. I always end up dead. Oh well, we just gotta go again. This time I'll just be quiet. Sorry if I'm not commentating, but that that's because I'm focused. So you just gotta focus on being a good spot. Because the next track is super easy. The next track is actually a really easy track. Uh, if I could just... Oh, man. I did not mean to do that. But if I could just kill one of, the, one of the CPU who's ahead of me in the table, then that would be nice. In the points-wise table. That's the Dark Schneider, and then I think the King Meteor. I forget who, though. Let me kill. Alright, let's focus. Let's focus. Let's go. Let's go, boys. Come on. Gotta be careful right here because I can fly off. You can fly off. If you go too fast, you can fly off. And then right here, you gotta worry about the uh, flying off. The this is a weird track. It's not shaped like a normal track. The physics in this game, too, can uh, make you fly off. And Billy is just pulling ahead. He's just way ahead. Look how far ahead he is. Oh, man, oh, man. All right. We uh, somehow caught up to them. Oh, but now Baba is up there. He's beeping. He's beeping. All right, come on. We're in fourth place. We can maybe we can snatch first place. Come on, come on. We're in second. We got a little bit of boost left. We got a little bit left. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. 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 We can do it. Yes. Did we do it? Yes, we did. All right. It just lagged. I was a little worried for a minute. All right. So really we got first place for now, because that is not an easy track to get first. It's not easy. So we have an 11-point gap. 
hopefully we can make that gap grow if we win in the next track. Three, two, one, let's go! And, all right, this is the first track where they introduce a pipe. And the entire track is pretty much pipe. So, oh, I don't know what the heck just happened there, but I'm not gonna question it because F-Zero GX physics are weird and questionable. We gotta keep our head on the swivel though. We really do. We wanna get as many dash plates as possible and not bump into too many cars and we should be able to get first place. Holy, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, that guy almost killed me, holy smokes, I'm almost dead, I'm almost dead, no, 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 oh my gosh, oh my gosh, because if I died there, I'd have to start all over, and that would not be fun, that would be not fun at all, that was close, gotta be careful. All right, just play smart, play smart. All right, these guys are getting a little far ahead, and whoa. I just screwed up so bad there. All right, listen, I'm not calling this a walkthrough, so I don't have to be perfect, but man, I just screwed up so bad there. And we got, we got to reclaim our spots, man. We're way behind. I don't know who our rival is, though. I think it's the Dark Schneider. But, oh, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. Whew. Close, close. Yeah, we're doing really bad on this track, and I said I should be able to win this, but... Well, like, I, I don't know. It's, it's F-Zero. Anything can happen. It's like football. Uh, Americans call it soccer, and yes, I'm American. But, we call it football because we're weird like that, but in football, anything can happen. In F-Zero X or F-Zero GX, anything can happen, and we're somehow second place, so maybe I should focus and, or maybe I should keep commentating, because commentating somehow got me to second spot, which, after giving that really bad run we just had of smashing into the pole, um, we are somehow first place, and we are somehow not gonna die, and we're somehow gonna finish this race in first place. Three first place finishes in a row. Awesome. That is awesome. We made a comeback somehow. Don't ask how that happened. We got a huge lead. Look at that. I think we have it won. As long as we finish, I think we have it won. But with the funny thing about this track, it's a deadly track. There's so it's literally called Meat City Serial Gaps. And you know, serial means death, so. And we have no more lives, so we gotta be careful. Very careful. But we don't have to finish too well, so we don't have much pressure on us. In fact, I'm going to use that to our advantage. Because the CPU, oh my gosh. They get aggressive. They get so aggressive on this track. Like on the last track, they weren't too aggressive. Alright, we'll take the bottom route. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. It's okay. Just gotta survive two more laps and we have the Sapphire Cup. Yes, I'm, I'm taking this because me usually I I race this track really well, but right now I'm super nervous. Oh my gosh, I'm just so nervous right now. 
I don't want to die. I don't want to screw this up because we've got massive lead. I'm all four seconds behind. We're four whole seconds behind, but we can do this. We can do this. I believe. I believe in us. If you think I can do this, smash that like button and subscribe. Maybe we can do this. All right, we're on the last stretch. We're on the last stretch. Here we go. Here we go. Let's climb up the table. Let's climb up the table. Come on. Smash that like button. All right. Yes. I did not win the track. But I got 22nd place, which is pathetic. But that means we won the Grand Prix, I hope. Right? Right? I mean, right? Right? Yes. Okay. By a lot, too. Yeah, the CPU, sometimes they're not that consistent. But given the amount of tracks that you have to do, you have five tracks. And they're difficult tracks. They're not easy tracks. But we got first place. It's very, very nice, very nice. Considering our starts and the setbacks we had in some tracks, we got three first place finishes in a row. So I'm going to skip through that because if you've been watching the video, then you've seen all that before. We raced it. But now we have F Zero TV. The best part of F Zero GX, of course. F Zero TV, who is brought. Though so he's gonna ask us a question. What is your vision of the future? What would you like to do in the future? I love Octoman. I love Octoman. Well, that settles it for today's episode of the F-Zero GX series. If you loved it, please leave a like, subscribe, and comment down below. And uh, I hope you enjoyed. My Discord server is in the description. If you want to join, feel free. This is Alderson signing out. Have a nice day.